What up people, Oli, I'm back, been away for a minute, but I had to jump back into the YouTube game. I see people posting lists left and right, best of 2016, so I had to join the party. Got a new camera, got some new kicks, so let's go! In my opinion, 2016 was a great year for sneakers. I stayed away from the hype releases, kept it real nice, low key. I like my shoes clean, comfortable, with quality. So, without further ado, here are my best picks of 2016. My honorable mention, great shoe, the Saucony Great SD Kushwacker, a collaboration with Sneaker Freaker. I picked this up on the low for around 90 bucks. So, I'm very happy with it. It didn't make the list, but it's such a great shoe, I had to put it on there as an honorable mention. Great, great, great quality. Great silhouette, superb colorway. Very happy I found this shoe for the low low. Sakani Great SD Kuchwacker. Number five on the list, the Fly Knit Presto. In the all white colorway. This is the only one I wanted, the all white Presto, comfortable, sleek, stylish. It was my alternative to the Ultra Boost All White. I like this one even better because not everybody's on it. This shoe was extremely, extremely comfortable, very fashionable, it goes with anything. If you have a chance to pick the shoe up, get it because you won't regret it. Just a great, great simple colorway on a great shoe. Number five, the Presto Fly Knit in All White. Number four on the list, the New Balance 998 from the Explored by the Sea Pack. I had the 997 too, but this one takes the cake by a little bit. And yeah, just look at it. <laughs> it's a great shoe, man. People are sleeping on the shoe. Uh, the olives, the Halloween leather, the white laces, the comfort, the build, the quality. Number four on the list, the New Balance 998 Explored by Sea. Number three on the list, the Saucony Grid SD from the Public Garden Packs. It came with two other colorways, a gray one and a black one. I opted for the olive, mintish type colorway. Really like this colorway, great quality, great materials. The leather is very soft, the suede is plush, the liner very comfortable. The salmon goldish hits, the cream midsole, can't go wrong, no brainer. People are sleeping on brands like Saucony, New Balance, Diodora. Caught up in the hype, don't sleep, get these ones on sale. You break necks and you save pockets. My number four on the list, Saucony, Great SD, Public Gardens, great shoe. Number two on the list is the Reebok Club C from the Butter Soft Pack. That this shoe is flawless, yet sits on the shelf. I don't care, because I can get it for sale. I got this one for sale, I got the whole pack. There's also a classic leather and a workout low. Got up all three. One of the best packs of the year. Low key release, love it. The quality is up there, the comfort is up there. Just a great shoe. I wear it all the time. So, so that said, my number two, Reebok Club C Butter Soft. Great shoe. And last but not least, my favorite shoe of the year. If you follow me on Instagram, which you should, Oli.Vida, you know which shoe this is. I've been posting it and posting it and posting it and trying to get people to buy this shoe. I don't know why, because I don't have no stakes in this brand, but you know what it is if you follow my Instagram. It's the New Balance 990 V2 in the gray colorway, the GRI, that's the official name. This shoe is a monster, it's a tank. Look at it, look at it! Gray, New Balance, quality, comfortable. I can't stop wearing this shoe. This is my favorite shoe of the year. If you want good quality shoes for a good, decent price, 
Get you some New Balances made in England or made in USA. Get you some Diodoras made in Italy. Get you some Sarkonis. Get you some Brooks. Get you some Brooks. Stop being a sheep. There's a lot out there. And this is one of them. New Balance. I love this shoe. Number one on my list. New Balance 990 GRIV2. So that was my top five of 2016. If you like videos like this, subscribe. This year, I'm going hard body on the YouTube. So hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button if you like this video. My name is Oli, your favorite Dutch YouTuber, and I'm out.